In the case of an Arizona school teacher accused of having a secret relationship with a teenage student. His parents uncovered the relationship with a phone app, and Amy is here with the details. Good morning, Amy. Yeah, George, this is a jaw-dropping story. The Arizona teacher is 27 years old, her student just 13, and software the parents installed on his phone led to a very dramatic arrest. This officer has a body cam on him as well, so... Um, a 27-year-old teacher pulled over and put in handcuffs, charged with sexual abuse, allegedly carrying on a secret relationship with one of her young students. We have to stop by them or we just pass them? We have to go in the door by them, okay? okay. We're not stopping. If you want to keep your head down, you can. His parents can be heard in this phone call, confronting the teacher from Goodyear, Arizona, about the abuse. You are a monster. You're a child molester. Do you understand me? And now we're learning more about how the young boy's parents uncovered the abuse after installing a program on their teen boy's phone that tracked his texts. They discovered illicit exchanges between teacher Brittany Zamora and their 13-year-old boy. The app is called Sentry, and it works by monitoring activity on teen cell phones and flagging key words that appear in text messages. One day, Sentry flagged repeated use of the word baby. The boy's mom saw the messages, and then his dad confronted his son. The distraught parents called the police. During an interview with investigators, the 13-year-old student describing the messages. She said, text her so she wouldn't be bored. And I said, hi, Ms. Moore. And she texted back, hi. And then, I, and then we just like started texting her. She was like, oh, MG, I love you. And I would tell her I'd love her too. And then she was like talking about how she wanted to do stuff with me. The boy telling investigators the text flirtations eventually turned physical, a scary reality for many parents. The U.S. Department of Education estimates that 4.5 million students, or 1 in 13, experience sexual misconduct at the hands of a school employee sometime between kindergarten and 12th grade. Now Zamora is behind bars, charged with eight counts of sexual misconduct with a minor, two counts of child molestation, and one count of transmitting obscene material. Brittany Zamora pleaded not guilty, but has surrendered her state teaching certificate. What else can you tell us about this app? So Sentry is available. We just looked it up on Android phones, not yet on the iPhones mm. yet. But certainly this has proved to be a very powerful tool for parents. I mean, it's a frightening story and one I think most parents can't even imagine happening. And yet here we are. Yeah, good for them to be on it. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.